my people of the world what's up i know another video oh my god i've just been cranking them out lately like seriously like one after the other after the other you know some in the same day you know it's crazy how i've been doing that well well you know i was gone for two weeks so i kind of have to make up for all that um okay so what am i going to talk about i'm going to be talking about swath snow white and the huntsman which is kristen's new movie um i watched the um i watched the blog first the live blog first and then i found some of the clips online so i'll be linking uh, all four of them down there um i'm also going to be talking about the breaking dawn comic con my favorite parts so, uh, yeah, I'm also going to be linking down the long, because, um, originally I could, I only found, I found, like, six parts, and, like, some of them were really, really short clips, and then I found one long one. I found the whole thing. Uh, not the one where they had the big screen, the one before that. So, yeah, and also the sound on that one is kind of, like, it's kind of echoey, but you can understand kind of what they're or saying and I've watched it so many times now because it's <laughs> so funny um, I'm actually gonna get right into that right now um, I especially <laughs> I love I love the part where they start talking about imprinting like uh, Taylor's like I was just really nervous about imprinting and he's like I had to be staring at an X on a wall and Kristen's like what did you want him to be in this room with you and Rob starts laughing they all start laughing and Taylor's like no I don't you know and then um he's like yeah I was walking into this room uh, on the verge of killing this baby and then I had to stop twist imprint and then you wait a second and then Rob just bursts out laughing and he's like <laughs> imprint <laughs> And then, you know, and then Taylor kind of gets it. It kind of sounds like a dance move. He's like, oh, stop, twist, imprint, bam. And then Rob's like, yeah, that's, he's like, yeah, that's Jacob's signature move. <laughs> it's like, Poof, imprint. I just love the part when Rob does that. I just love that part. He's like, Poof, imprint. <laughs> oh, my God. You know, do the twist. And that was my favorite part. And I also love when, um. Kristen's explaining when they had work with the animatronic baby, which ugh, I kind of died a little inside because the fact of the fact that they did end up having to use for one uh, animatronic baby for one scene, and it just kind of killed me a little bit. Especially, I agree with Kristen because the scene they have to use it in is when uh, Bella is first uh, introduced to Renesme after she's changed into a vampire, and I kind of died a little inside because that is. Also, one of my favorite scenes in the book inc involving Renesme and with Bella and Edward and stuff. And I'm like, oh, really? You know, and so Kristen was explaining, like, how just, just grossed out she was by, like, the hand and everything. She's like, yeah, it, like, touches you and then it pulls. And she's like, ah. I love the part where she's like, oh, get this thing off me. I died so much. And you could totally tell she just did not like that part. And... Oh, God. Well, they're amazing actors, so I'm sure it'll be all okay. And that part, that scene's probably not going to be until part two, so, yeah. Um, oh, especially the one, the one panel they had with the big screen. Uh, I love the part with the little girl. If you guys have seen that little girl, she is, like, adorable. She's just like, I have a question for Rob. And she's so sweet. Everyone starts aw awing like cute. And then she's like, did you like having the baby with Bella? And it's just the cutest thing ever. <laughs> you know, there's like a long pause of people like clapping and awing. And then Rob's like, that your face right now. It seems like you're trying to ask me something else. And I'm like, oh, Rob, really? <laughs> oh, Rob, such a jokester. And then he, you know... He's just, God, I love him. And he's like, and then he's like, yeah, I, I like a anything with babies and stuff. You know, his thing. He's like, I love babies, so. I love an eclipse when, he, and the eclipse come in. He's like, I love babies, so anything with a baby, I'm fine. And I'm like, aw, cutie. Um, yeah, there were so many parts in the Breaking Dawn thing that I loved, so I'll put that link to that really long video in there. 
Um, and Snow White and the Huntsman, let's get down to it. I am so excited for that. I was kind of, like, hesitant. I mean, I wasn't hesitant because I, I like Snow White, like, the Disney version, but I knew for a fact that it wasn't going to be like Disney. I knew for a fact it wasn't going to be like, I don't think, I mean, I'm not saying Kristen's not the, I don't think Kristen is that type of person to pick a role like that because her roles in the past have been so different from anything. Like, they've all been equally different in their own way. And, and like, all her worlds are kind of, like, similar to each other and then and then completely different in their own way. And, um, so the fact that Snow White, Snow White and the Husband looks completely badass just kind of makes me happy. So I'm going to show y'all something. My, okay, yeah, it's plugged in. Um, show you some pictures that I, okay, bear in mind you, it's really bad quality. Oh, I didn't get the whole E part. Anyway, so here's a picture for Kristen, Snow White. Doesn't she look... It does. I didn't get the full picture because I, I took this off of my computer. So, yeah. Sorry for the bad, uh, you know, quality. But doesn't she look completely badass? I love her in that. And then Charlize Theron as the queen. And Chris Hemsworth. I watched the uh, the four part for the panel, and a lot of girls are screaming about him. I'm sorry, but he's not cute. <laughs> I'm sorry if you don't agree with me, but I don't think he's cute. And then the prince, he doesn't even look. He's a he's a nice guy apparently. The prince, the oh, the prince, prince charming, and he doesn't look like a prince to me. This is a bad picture that it, you can't really see on the screen, but he doesn't. I don't know. In my opinion doesn't really look like a prince. But anyway, I have a little bit of a bone to pick with Charlize. Um, not a little, not like a bone. I'm not mad at her or anything. I mean, I was originally, but now I'm just kind of chilled with it because I've seen the, because, okay, I watched the blog and then I found the clips online. So basically, like, Charlize was, was kind of egging on Kristen, kind of, you know, she's kind of like, there's this one part where, um, I got, like, um, uh, I think um, Trillian was asked, like, how do you feel acting with Kristen, or how do you feel acting, with, you know, because Kristen is from the Breaking Dawn series, obvious Breaking Dawn series, haha, <laughs> Twilight Saga, so she's used to, like, you know, like, possibly, because Snow White might become, like, a trilogy or something, because there's, like, rumors about that, so... I think they were at, like, Charlize was asked, like, how do you feel about taking on this actress who is obviously very, um, used to movies that might become trilogies or something along the lines, and she's like, well, she's like, well, I don't know, she said something, 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 and then she says, and Brit, and bitch, bring it on, not, like, in a bitchy kind of way, but she kind of just said it in, like, a joking way, and she did that a lot, like, Kristen even said, yeah, I'm not good with stunts, I don't even know why I'm doing this, and then Charlize's like, oh, we can get you steroids. And I'm just like, really? Was that appropriate? Really? <laughs> I mean, I, I know Kristen knew that it was... I know Kristen, like, probably didn't care. She's like, okay, sure. But, um, and she, you know, Kristen laughed it off. But I kind of got really defensive. And I'm like, you, you meanie. <laughs> I don't know why I decided to get defensive. Kristen's my, Of course I do. Kristen's my, my girl. One of my girls. Like, my main person, actress that I love to death, and I just don't like it when people get really mean. And also, they, uh, the, Kristen, Charlize, um, Chris, and, um, I don't know the other guy's name. <laughs> um, I don't remember the, wait, Dory, I could just look on my iPod, one second. Uh, Sam, who plays the prince. How, like, they don't even really know each other at all. They barely knew each other. So, like, and the fact that they were kind of, like, Shirley's was kind of egging Kristen on a little bit, you know? I kind of, I mean, I kind of get it. Like, you're trying to, like, loosen things up and getting to know each other, kind of getting a feel for everyone. But I think there's a time for that, and then there's a time for being professional. And, I mean, some of her comments were okay because Kristen laughed them off, but some of them were kind of not okay in my opinion they, i'm like you should probably not just wait till you get to know Kristen a little bit you know and then start egging her on like that or just, just stop you know i'm sorry and no way do i hate Shirley's 
but like in the beginning when I was just reading the blog, I was like, you asshole. <laughs> I was getting so defensive. I was like, I wasn't screaming at my laptop because that would just be weird because my dad would be like, what are you doing screaming in your room? But I was just like, Ugh! I wanted to like, I was just like, you bitch, you know, and everything. But Kristen was okay with it and I'm okay with it. So yeah, I love her either way. So yeah. Also, 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 before I start getting into my personal life of, yeah, why am I making this vlog so late? Um, at night when I really should be finishing doing other stuff. Anyway, Rob's hair. I have to start talking about that. Rob's hair. I, the one thing I hate, the one thing I hate is that people think that he did this on, he like did this like just on his own. Like he's like, I'm just going to have half my, half my hair shaved. I'm just gonna have, I'm just gonna do that, cause I'm, I can't, I can get away with it, but no. He did this with Cosmopolis, cause in Cosmopolis, uh, the main point of this, this, um, this, uh, ba ba ba. I had the word in my head, and now it's gone. Shut up. <laughs> my pod decided to make a noise, love it. Uh, oh, by the way, thank you to those who helped me with the words that the word that I was thinking of for the Breaking Dawn thing reaction video. I was thinking of the word prolonging or stalling. Yeah, thank you. <sighs> Elongate, really. That makes me think of something totally not right. And uh, images, anyway. But anyway, like now people like for Rob's hair, like in Cosmopolis, the, uh, Eric Packer, his main point in the book is he wants to go across Manhattan, I believe that's where it is, and get a haircut. So that's why his hair is half shaved. Because I have a feeling something happens to Eric as he's getting his haircut. So yeah that's why his hair is partially saved but honestly i normally don't really give a crap if rob's hair is like that um like gets haircut like when he had his hair like shaved uh right after twilight i was just like oh my god he's sexy everyone else in the free world is like oh my god he cut his beautiful hair like calm down it grows back shush the one thing i just the, this time it's like it's shaved half of his head and then his the rest of his hair is like okay which means it's going to grow weird. That means it's just going to grow in weird. And that's what me and, me and Natasha would, me and Natasha were talking about that earlier. It's like his hair is going to grow in crazy. And now people are starting to come up with names for it. Okay, so here it is. One, the semi. The Edward Cullen hands. That doesn't make sense. Uh, business on the right, party on the left. It's actually kind of funny. Uh, four, the half breed. That's like my favorite. That's one of my favorites. Five, the my clippers have a mind of their own. Okay. Uh, the goose and a weed whacker. That doesn't make sense. Uh, the busted buzz. Uh, the wave. The half pit and my absolute favorite. The fuck you. I'm still sexy. Want to con? Ah, I call it. I cut it. I messed that up. Ten. The fuck you. I'm still sexy. That's what I'm calling it. Because he can pull off anything. He's still sexy, and you know it, and you guys can suck it, and yeah. Because he still looks hot, even though I I really hope Kristen kind of, like, makes him go shave his head. Because I swear, if I was her, I'd just be like, Rob, I love you. Your hair is amazing, but please, please help yourself to get a full buzz cut. Or something like try to or maybe you know what you know what he should do he should do the thing like his haircut in uh, water for elephants he should just like save equal sides so he can just have the party up in the front <laughs> like he did with water for elephants because that's how his hair was in water for elephants so he should probably do that again because I thought that haircut was hot holy crap okay so I'm gonna make another video right after this one of talking about what's going on with my life at the moment so yeah Please look down in Rob's box of drawer for a lot of the links I was talking about. So, yeah. Bye. Awkward ending to the video. Yay.